Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to Beer Geek Nation. I'm your host, Chris. Thank you so much for joining me once again for another beer review. And today, guys, we're looking at a Canadian craft beer. This one is from Quebec. It is from Dudicie. This is their Rigor Mortis. It's an, as they call it, Abbey-style brown ale. Um, basically what it is, it's a 10.5% Belgian-style quadruple. Um, you guys may know Dudicie from Peshmore Town, which is an amazing coffee imperial stout. If you haven't had that, definitely check it out. So looking forward to this one. They do some really Really great big beers. So let me get into a glass that you guys know it smells, tastes, and give you the final verdict on Rigor Mortis from Dudicier. All right, guys, the appearance on the Rigor Mortis. You know, it pours that murky, mucky looking brown that you expect in a quad. Looks like cola or iced tea. Very, very light to moderate carbonation on this one. Definitely seeing it on the sides of the glass. Uh, decent amount of lacing. The head that is there, almost non existent. Uh, it was a khaki, off white head. Good amount of head lacing on it. Definitely seeing some alcohol legs in there. Would expect it. And I just want to mention the bottle work, the artwork on the bottle is just fantastic. Really, really good stuff and just a classic looking quad. All right guys, the aroma on the rigor mortis. Wow, big, big fruity beer. You know, most of the time you expect raisin figs, slight raisin and fig in this one, but I'm getting big cherry juice, cordial cherry notes, slight bit of chocolate, a big, big burnt caramel, a nice spiciness in there from the Belgian yeast strain. Definitely a sweetness, a roastiness, um, a little bit of a phenolic kind of twinge to it from the alcohol. Yeah, just a big, sweet, fruity smelling beer. All right, guys, the taste on the Riga Mortis. And I have to say it like that for some reason. Cheers. Wow, that is a big, big beer. Right at the front of the tongue, there's almost no bitterness immediately slapped by big fig and raisin juice type of characters. Middle of the mouth, that cherry starts to pop through, a cherry juice, again, like a chocolate cherry cordial almost. Big burnt caramel characteristics. There's a slight bitterness in the middle of the mouth, um, definitely getting uh, almost a chocolate type of taste in there, playing off that sweetness from the dark fruits, really nice. Um, again, a very big burnt caramel, nice sweet, almost syrupy, sugary kind of flavor to this one. Aftertaste, more sweet, uh, more sweetness, dark fruits, cherries, plums, figs, just coats your mouth. This beer definitely feels like a 10.5%. It just feels like a beer that wants to be in charge. Just a big, big quad, exactly what a quad should be. All right, guys, so the final verdict, the Riga Mortis from Dudicie, 10.5% available now, guys. This one's gonna get an A for me. This is easily one of the best quads I've had from outside of Belgium. Just huge mouthfeel, big, big dark fruit flavors, a cherry characteristic. It just feels like a big, mean quad. How a quad should uh, feel, like your Rochefort 10 or St. Bernardus 12, just something like that. A lot of uh, American quads can tend to be a little bit watery, a little bit boozy, just real hot. This one, 10.5%, you taste that alcohol, but it backs it up with a mean, mean characteristic of that dark fruit, big body, just a big, sweet, malty beer and fantastic stuff. If you love quads, definitely, definitely check this one out. It is world class. So with that said, getting an A for me, and remember folks, life is too short. Drink amazing beers. Cheers.